Hey everybody, happy Friday. This is Cynthia Reed with Better Than Donuts Travel and Tours. BetterThanDonuts.com R&L Group LLC and uh, something that I just wanted to just share with you all. I'm kind of out in the country, not really that far from where I live, uh, but I'm at the ARF Animal Rescue Fund building. And uh, those of you who are pet lovers, I know some of you out on next door seem to have a love for animals and things. But COVID kind of messed up stuff for a lot of people, not just for people physically, but when it came to our animal friends, our animal family members. So I said to myself, I'm going to go out here to ARF because... I did not know that they are solely self-sufficient. In other words, they receive no tax dollars, a lot like the senior center where I'm on the board. Uh, they receive donations and grants. The building that you see behind me is in need of replacement. Uh, those folks that do so much. Oh, look, this, I've got a little friend coming up here. <laughs> Looks like a border collie. There is he. There he is. Uh, but this little area, for those of you who need a place for your stressed out animals, I mean, 4th of July really kind of stressed a lot of animals out. So what I'm saying to you is that there's this bark park back here. And this is land. All this land was donated by a, um, a family years ago. The story behind how ARF got started is hilarious. So um, go to Muncie Arf, I believe it is. I'll have the link here you can go to online and read the backstory. Uh, being a journalist, I love backstories on how things got started. But uh, here I am out here on a Friday, the 14th of July, and it's actually the 68th anniversary of my father's, my birth father's transition. So having set this up, like I did I had no idea the things that we all go through grieving animals kind of help us with that um, and if you have like any type of stress this bark park back here you're thinking well why is it charged to use anytime I wouldn't come out here at night because there are deer out here too but for a hundred dollars a year uh, Deb who is the one of the ladies who works the administration give them a call Again, I'll have the link here underneath this, um, or maybe with this video. Um, $100 a year to have your own private key to go to the bark park. Well, why is that? Because they have to repair the fence. <laughs> Again, they're out here with, there's corn over this way behind me. We're out here in the country. I'm out on Riggin Road. And uh, it takes a lot of maintenance. So for $100 a year, they are supporting people who are supporting their pets, their own stress and, and their own, their pet stress. Again, if those of you who know me know what my week has been like, your family's going through um, a very, very challenging time. Uh, we all have transitions and this just happens to be again, the memorial of 68 years. I was only 10 months old when my birth father passed and Mama remarried Daddy, who passed six years ago, about. I just share my heart with people, you know, and people sometimes they get it and sometimes they don't. But I think if we all shared our heart with people more, we'd have a much happier world, a much happier community. But here at ARF, they do donations. They, um, they can't take in everything and everybody. So before you bring your animal out, call them. They have... Um, free food out here on certain days I believe today Friday they have a free food you know cats and whatever and I've seen this with my own eyes I've watched people come in here and donate uh, food the science diet stuff you know for animals and dogs and cats that have digestive issues I can relate to that <laughs> after what I went through last year with my major major upheaval again those of you who know me already know my story i'm not going to repeat it but um they've got you know a place out here called ollie's red i'm sorry ollie's bed and biscuit for the mm, 
the ones that are kind of the bad actors. They have a foster program. If you want to foster an animal, uh, then call ARF and let them know. They have volunteers. Ball State helps them in a big, big way with volunteers. And I'm so glad to hear that. But one thing that they do have an issue with, and this is all over the country, is veterinary um, it's getting kind of hot here. Okay. Vet, veterinary um, help. Deb can tell you that story if you just want to sit down and call. But, yeah, there don't take vets for granted. It's an eight-year training program, and uh, they can't find enough of them, especially after COVID. Half of the people in veterinary schools, and there isn't even one in Kentucky, but half of the ones in veterinary schools, they said we can't do this anymore covid has affected so many people in so many ways where we just never think about it but anyway what i'm going to do is i've talked a little over five minutes so i'm going to get off of here but give ark a call dogs the, the kittens are so cute and the dogs you know they have a a place where you can like a meet and greet uh, i'm sure that they would not mind getting a call from someone out there who's interested in helping them uh, and especially with seniors senior center folks you know something come on out and find out what you can do possibly volunteer um, find out what you can do to foster an animal don't just bring in and they have strict guidelines so don't just eh, I'll just drop them off out here no can't do that there are policies and procedures that must be followed just like in travel and speaking of travel, if you have an organization that wants to do a fundraiser, a fundraising group cruise, whether it's a river cruise in Europe or a river cruise in the United States, an ocean cruise on any of the major cruise lines, and even some you may not have heard of before, like Pearl Cruises that goes up around the Great Lakes, give me a call. Give my husband and I a call. We've been doing this since 2008 voraciously first two years was just kind of getting our feet wet no pun intended with the cruises but even all-inclusive resorts whether it's just a little getaway we have vacation homes rvs go to better than donuts.com and click on the products menu and there's a drop down just check it all out but i'm telling you there's so much money in travel trillions with a t not billions trillions so what I'm saying to you all is go there to our site, betterthandonuts.com. Click fund your cause. That is where our heart is, my husband and I. Go there, click the vortex, learn how to save money. Go to Diamond Tours at betterthandonuts.com and get a group together for refreshing your mind, your body, your soul, your spirit. Because we're all here for a limited number of years. What we do with those years actually defines the whole in the legacy of your life. Get it? Better than donuts. The legacy of your life. Cynthia Reed out here at the ARF Animal Rescue Fund. Her telephone number is, I'm staring right at it, 765-282-2733. And their website is MuncieArf.com. See, right in front of my face. I didn't even have to look too hard. Anyway, Cynthia Reed signing off. God bless. Have a beautiful life. Enjoy nature. Enjoy your day. God bless.